hilariously, my power has gone out. So you're getting the roughest version of this that I could possibly do. I am currently recording this on my laptop. I'll have to edit it on my laptop. And uh, I'm using what I believe is the onboard mic. <laughs> Well, it has to be the onboard mic since there's no other microphones plugged in because no other microphones will plug in. And apologies for the quality of this, but uh, I don't like missing uploads, so we're just going to make it work. But yeah, I've tried starting this recording and stopping it like three or four times. Power is currently on. Uh, thank God, because my laptop will probably run out of power trying to record. But it keeps going off and on as I'm trying to work. Uh, and I, I need to, and I basically need to be able to do this without it. You know, my main computer is not uh, packed up by a battery, so um, yeah, that's a thing. Fantastic! Let's get started. SCP-5000 exists. Doctor Sumerian. Nobody cares. I mean, I'm yeah. Who cares? Is the question? I was reading the comments of this, and someone was like, "I don't think he got it. That must be the pro." No, I got it. I understand what's going on there. I don't. I. It's one of those things where it's like, if the SCP Foundation is murdering everyone in the world, I don't care why, because they're murdering everyone in the world. If, uh, if that bothers you, I apologize. 208, do not state your name, nickname, codename, alias, or any other personal designation. Well, in the presence of a native entity, Dr. Japers, no, please go on. These things are of interest to me. I am a fellow scholar, remember? Congratulations, you played yourself. This is uh, very true. <laughs> Primarily uh, interesting because it's the only rule out of like a thousand extra words in that article that actually means a goddamn thing towards the actual story. The rest of it is all just set dressing, which is incredibly annoying once you get through it and realize that. Canon, Dr. Bright. Nothing in life matters. Fanon, Dr. Bright. Nothing in life matters! Uh, I mean, that's not necessarily true. There's lots of actual SCP uh, articles, slat, well, not articles, but uh, tales involving Bright where he's exactly that way. There's uh, two versions of Bright, the wacky and the serious. And I don't think that they're necessarily mutually exclusive. Hello, Monica from Doki Doki Literature Club. Hello, Dr. Sumerian from SCP... Secure, contain, protect. I don't... I don't get it, but it involves Dr. Sumerian. I would probably have to play this game in order to get it. Maybe... Maybe it's a play on how similar the images are? I guess? Maybe? I don't know. Dr. Wojak, did you capture the anomaly? Uh, no. The Global Occult Coalition got to us. Got to it before us. They must have been given a tip or something. Yeah, more Siren Head stuff. Siren Head is not an SCP. And it's not in the SCP universe. Leave it alone. It's not going to be released under Creative Commons. And it shouldn't be, because the person who owns it wants to keep it that way. And it's intellectual property. God damn it. Leave it alone. Leave it. Leave Siren Head alone. God, that's a meme that's so old, most of you probably won't get it. And that makes me sad. Anyway... The U.S. government and the game control. The FBC has this world altered world event under control. Don't worry about a thing. The U.S. government and the SCP universe. If anyone from any other organization gives you... No, it's just the UIU. That's the thing. People forget this. UIU is not necessarily the only organization that the U.S. government has that handles <laughs> anomalous things. In fact, there's... <coughs> Almost certainly a number of U.S. Uh, military intelligence uh, units that handle anomalous things beyond just DARPA. I think DARPA is in the Army, but I could be wrong. Regardless, like there are many uh, agencies in the U.S. that handle it. The UIU is just the most inept. Dr. Sumerian putting your meme into a video. R slash dank memes from Site19. That's a, that's a cute cat. Dear Broken Church, if the Cogwork Orthodoxy are the Tickers and the Maxwellists are, I'm sorry, the Maxwellists are the Hummers, then are the Mechanites Boomers? Okay. Foundation 426's file. Haha, <laughs> funny toaster breaks grammar. Serpent hands 426 file. It is a monster taking over the entire universe. 
which is about right since uh i mean the entire universe is a toaster after all oh i saw this somebody linked me this i think it was yossi yossi linked me this so uh, what are you lot in for i can slow down photons and use them to craft various items uh, i get a miniature version of earth in my chest uh se seals won't stop abusing me fuck you carl sorry carl he, you don't you know he doesn't mean it carl you bastard get over here and someone was like why is that guy got a uh uh, why is that guy carrying a seal around? And I, and, and I read the comments, and apparently, it, it, which is even more interesting, uh, this guy's anomaly is that he has a seal in his torso. <laughs> so that's great. I love it. And and then another comment was, uh, I love that Carl's first response is to run away. Also, if you look real close in the, t in the first frame, you can find Waldo. Ah, uh, yeah. I should probably put this on a poster. Reading 100 word long general Generation 1 articles. Generation should be series. Reading 1,000 word Generation 3 articles. Reading 7 kilometer long Generation 5 articles. I don't, that doesn't seem fair. Maybe it is fair, I don't know. I've, I haven't read a lot of modern articles anymore, like the Series 5 stuff and Series 6 stuff. Uh, it's just uh, not, not, I've been spending so much time on this. Creating a uh, really shit SCP when I was 14. Crippling fear of rejection of ideas and overall feeling of worry that my ideas are unoriginal and terrible. Dropping self-esteem to unimaginable lows. Yeah. And you don't have to be 14 years old for that to happen. You know, this is particularly ironic, which we'll talk about in a second. Seven-year-old nephew talking about how Siren Head is an SCP, Intellectual Property Lecture. Dr. Sumerian. Okay, so... um. When I was, I, I tweeted this out that my, because I was sitting at not Memorial Day. What was the last holiday before that? I don't remember. But we were we were sitting at like a maybe it was Mother's Day. Maybe it was Mother's Day. I don't know. We were sitting at the dinner table with my family, and my nephew was talking about how Siren Head is an SCP. And actually, the exact exchange was something along the lines of Siren Head, Siren Head, Siren Head. Uh, dad, hey, what's Siren Head? And uh, and my nephew going, uh, it's an SCP. And I was like, stop, get some help. Because I was like, I literally like stopped him and stopped the whole conversation like an asshole. And was like, you no, it's not an SCP. The creator of it doesn't want it to be an SCP. And you need to understand that because saying that it's an SCP is, da is potentially damaging to the... Uh, to that man's intellectual property and then i tweeted about it because well i thought it was an interesting exchange um the reason why this is ironic is because the underlying stuff behind let's not get into how meme reviews are actually likely a problem when it comes to copyright i really don't think it's necessary for us to talk about that but me putting this up on the screen right now is itself a potential copyright issue so you know Keep that in mind. Anyway, that said, uh, uh, sorry again for the quality of the video. Uh, I'm yeah, the power was on for the entirety of this recording. I feel like I could have done better, but uh, it keeps doing the thing, and I can't rely. Oh, well, you know what? The internet's not working anyway. I'm having to do. I'm gonna have to upload this on my cell phone. <laughs> so yeah, this is still this is still a problem. All right. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. If you um, like the video, please hit the subscribe button. I promise you the quality is normally better than this. Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell next to that so you're uh, updated when I upload new videos. And then head on over to patreon.com forward slash dsumerian and join SCP-6277. Let's get that correct. Double, let's double check that. SCP-6277, who is pledged at $50 a month. A Little Lass, who is pledged at $40 a month. Lawful Evil, who is pledged at $40 a month. And probably a wizard and definitely not a scientist, who is pledged at $40 a month. Thank you all, and thank everyone else for letting me know that I'm not alone out here. And I'll see you all again on Thursday.